Now, one of the biggest attractions, and no one should be surprised, at Aero India 2023 are the pair of aircraft that you see behind me. In case you haven't recognized them already, these are the F-35 Lightning II. They're fifth generation fighter aircraft and the latest fighters to be developed by the United States. They're in service with the United States, but you're wondering what the hell are these two aircraft doing here at Aero India? Let me first tell you that the F-35 is making its debut here in India. These aircraft have never been in Indian airspace, certainly never on Indian soil. And here they are at the Yelahanka Air Base. The big question that we're asking right now is, why are these aircraft here? Remember, whenever an aircraft breaks cover, makes its debut here uh, at the Aero India show, it basically means that there's something afoot. We can tell you here in India today that the F-35 has had an India connection for a very long time. Over a decade ago, the F-35 was said to be uh, unofficially in contention for an Indian Navy requirement, but it has always remained on the sidelines of the Indian Air Force's own requirement. For a very long time, remember, the Indian Air Force has been trying to get fighters. They've been trying to get, uh, uh, you know, modern, uh, uh, multi-role, new generation fighter aircraft. Not been very successful. They managed to get a few Rafals a few years ago. But Lockheed Martin, basically the company that builds and develops the F-16 fighter, has been unsuccessful so far in selling F-16s here in India for various reasons. And the F-35 is basically the successor to the F-16s. This is the fighter that has replaced an entire generation of fighter aircraft uh, in the United States Air Force from Harriers to F-16s uh, to F-15s to other kinds of aircraft. And now for this fighter to come here at the Aero India show sends out a very big message. Is the United States saying, we want to offer you now the best? Are they trying to change the game for the Indian Air Force by saying, we're going to open up the doors to a fifth generation fighter for you? Is this something that will impress the Indian Air Force and the Indian government? Now, that's a tantalizing question to ask. What is beyond doubt, however, is that the F-35 has been one of the most expensive aircraft to develop by the, Indian, by the U.S. Air Force and the United States government. It has taken a long time coming. It was a fiercely fought battle, but the F-35 in many ways has proven itself. It still has various technical problems, many troubles, but for the F-35 to be here today, courtesy the U.S. Air Force, courtesy Lockheed Martin, which has been extremely aggressive in its pitch to the Indian Air Force, sends out a firm message that the United States means business as far as India's requirements is concerned. If you like the video, do like, comment, share and subscribe.